This may be your last chance if you want a V8 engine. Dodge says that they will end production of their V8 engines on December the 31st, 2023. It is expected that Jeep, Ram and Chrysler will do the same. In the 1960s to early 1970s, most manufacturers had V8s in every model. Saving the day, Land Rover just announced the Defender 130 V8. After driving it, I can tell you it's got more power than an angry corgi. This bad boy is packing a 5-litre supercharged V8 engine that can go from 0 to 60 miles an hour in just 5.4 seconds. That's faster than Lewis Hamilton in a go-kart. So all three Defenders, the 90, the 110 and the 30, were on the drawing board at the same time for Jerry McGovern. Although we saw them staggered and released at different times, this, the 130, looks like every other Defender from the front. It has Defender written across the hood. It has air intakes here and here. It has nice cladding and functional everything. At the back, it's longer. It has the three rows. It extends behind the rear wheels enough to get that extra row in. You can't tell the 130 V8 from the V6 at the front. From the back, you'll notice something different. The V8 has quad exhausts. Those quad outboard mounted exhausts make it sound like the British Army is coming to invade. Oh, sorry, too soon? With companies like General Motors and Volvo pledging to go all electric, they won't make any V8 vehicles anymore. The interior is just as posh as the exterior with a 14-way heated and cooled electric driver's memory seat that is softer than the freshly laundered tea towels I have at home. Plus, it's got four-zone climate control and a Meridian sound system that will make you feel like you're in a concert in Hyde Park. It's got wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto what three words addressing technology, and Alexa voice AI so you can tell your Defender to make you a cuppa while you're driving down the M1. With most brands moving away from V8 vehicles, this might be one of the last you get an opportunity to drive and buy. I'm Nick Miles.